ha, 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 ha. Please do not roast me. I have no idea what this is. I think it's toothpaste. I went back to CrossFit. Oh! And I haven't been in like nine months. And I'm sure. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. Yay! Yeah! Welcome back. I really want to take... <laughs> Oh, Jawline deactivated. I did all look like a puffer fish. The fuck? I really want to take the new year to come up with like a name, like something that I can call the people that watch my videos. All eight of you guys. Leave it down in the comments below a name that you want to be called. What's up, guys? That's too generic. What's up, everyone? Don't like it. What's up, fucking slut? What's up, you fucking pieces of shit. Today, we are gonna be playing the worst rated apps on the app store. So there are a lot of really terrible apps that I've downloaded in my time, but after doing some research, apparently there's even more than I thought. Got me fine. Oh my God, iPhone ASMR. Sexy, that's hot. So I found this article and they talk about the worst rated games on the app store. And the first one they discuss is Pocket Kitten Cat Go. <laughs> that is a name, that is a name. I guess this is it, Pocket Cats Go. I have nothing to say, but it's very, very cool. Pocket Cats Go, here we go, here we go. Your task is to find all the cats that are hiding in the real world. Use your phone's camera and built-in radar. So it's like Pokemon Go. Okay, I can do that. I've played Pokemon Go before in the past. Once you meet the cat, aiming camera and activate red ball. Wait, what? 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 Once you meet the cat, aiming camera. <laughs> okay, first of all, am I stupid? No, sometimes, but I just can't read this. Once you meet the cat, aiming camera, activate red ball to catch his. <laughs> Okay, I don't know who made this, but please get a proofreader, god damn! I guess I'll show you around my bedroom. First of all, oh. Oh my god. Do I catch it? How do I do it? How do I catch it? Okay, so I found a cat on my bed. First of all, can we talk about how the camera, how blurry it is? What do I do? Oh, there we go. I just, I just tap it. You catch Schultz, cat of the noble breed. Considers himself top intellectuals, cannot wait for him petting in games. He angrily looks at what is happening around. What? Oh, an ad, an ad. And then we're gonna try to meet another cat. Oh my God, the camera is literally so distorted. Oh my God, look at my leg. Looks all fucked up. Can I please get a cat? It's crunchy. Oh. White and fluffy on the outside, military and prickly inside. What does that mean? Do not hurt him. He can recall about it, rip curtains and wet sneakers. Bitch, what? <laughs> I don't know what they're saying. So we're gonna go ahead and stop. So the next one we're going to download is called Disney Emoji Blitz. Not the biggest Disney fan. <laughs> Sore. I am hungry. The hell I'm gonna eat for dinner. It's 2 p.m. <coughs> Little kids cough like this. <coughs> I need to do another. <laughs> I need to do the. Bitch, why can't I speak? Come on, come on. I need to do another Asmir video. It's time to play Emoji Blitz. It's finally downloaded. Pick your first emoji. Hmm, I'm gonna do Simba. Animals run left and right to clear a row of emojis. What does that even mean? Oh, bitch, this is, this is literally just another type of Candy Crush game. I'm not playing this. I cannot tell you how many games I've downloaded and I'm thinking it's one thing and it turns out to be a Candy Crush style game. They advertise it as one thing and then they completely f you. They completely say <laughs> and they, <laughs> they make you download a game like Emoji Disney Blitz. The next one we're doing is called Talking Horse. The still that they have when talking about this app is just so terrifying. The image that they have for this horse is truly terrifying. <laughs> Sorry it's so dark in here, you guys. Like, I need to just haul. You see, here's the ting. I usually film at my parents' house. I've been so busy that I have been going over there. So, you know what? No more excuses, 2020. <laughs> All right, 
I don't know why my computer, it sounds like it's gonna blow the fuck up every day. I really hope this is a good app. Well, actually, that's the point. I'm not playing good app. <laughs> Bitch. Ew. That is so creepy. Ew. Look at this interface, you guys. It's so nasty. What the fuck? Ew. Oh my god, its face oh, is so nasty. Oh. Actually, though, like this video if you think talking horse is sexy. So I'm reading this article and it's saying that you basically, it says, <laughs> it's like one of those apps. It's like one of those apps. Bitch, I hope the fuck you do. You be a dead son of a bitch, I'll tell you that. This isn't funny. Uh, shut up. Shut up. Oh, you might. I'll fucking kill you. Bitch. I'll fucking swear to God. I'll fucking fucking face up, bitch. I'll fucking kill you, bitch. I'll fucking swear to God. I'll fucking 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 face up, bitch. Oh no. Y'all, this interface really sucks. Listen to this song. Oh, she's sleep now. This app ain't for kids. To do any of the other stuff, you have to buy coins. One critique I'm about to give to all app developers out there, stop making people pay for some bullshit. Like this clearly is not a good app and you're making people pay for shit. Stop making people pay for some bullshit. Like this clearly is not a good app and you're making people pay for shit. That is all period. We're gonna play a mini game because it's the only thing I can actually afford on this app. Oh shit. Oh shit, I love these games. I fucks with this. I used to love these games. <laughs> Fuck this game. The next game I'm gonna play is this app called Zigzag. It says it's a casual game. Oh, I think I know what I have to do. Stop it, no. I barely even started. <laughs> Bitch, huh? What, no. No, please. Do I have to hold it like this? Itching and itching, uh, itching. Oh, so now my best score is one. Oh, okay, so you have to use your, oh. Bitch, that's really hard. Bitch, I'm done. Bitch, I'm done. I'm done. I will not be playing it again. Okay, no offense, but the game sucks. User, it is not user friendly. The next game we're gonna play is this game called Granny. It's like one of those scary games. Basically, this granny is hunting you. <laughs> Warning, do not play if you have nightmares. Be quiet. Keep in mind that if you drop objects on the floor, it creates sound. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie, I'm scared. I don't like this. I'm also home alone. I don't like this. Bro, I can't see shit. Ew, what is that noise? I cannot see. Oh shit, is that her? Bro, she gonna be right there. Oh shit. She about to come find me, bitch. I just dropped something. Oh no, okay, bitch. I hate this. Hey, hey, hey. This game, first of all, the controls are just... <laughs> she literally went... I have to leave this house. I can't like turn around. I'm confused, like, okay, this volume cannot go all the way up because I will scream and I will cry. I'm gonna hold it like how my mom holds her phone. She literally- <laughs> Bitch, I didn't even get the chance. <laughs> I didn't even get the chance. Day three. Day three in the his house. Okay. <laughs> how do I open the door? How do I open this damn door? Uh-uh. Your mom. I hear her walking, I think. I'm hiding, though. <laughs> Didn't like that noise. Didn't like that. Okay. Okay, so the next game we're gonna play is a religious one. Way to go from killer granny to Jesus Christ. We love the juxtaposition. When you come to this channel, you get versatility, you get an array, an array of things. This game is called Follow JC Go. Enter your country. H-I-J-K-L-M-N-O-P. Q R S T U T R S. Get you a bitch who Q -R -S knows her ABCs. T U T U T United. Okay, so America is not on here. That's fine. Enter your Dicose. Bitch, what? What? Enter your Dicose. Enter your di Diocese. Oh my god. <laughs> 
I literally was, I grew up Catholic. I should know this. A diocese, I'm just gonna say Ligma because I don't know. Enter your parish, parish these nuts, observations, atheist. <laughs> I'm gonna say arthritis. I don't think I spelt arthritis right. Nope. So. It's like my gender. I don't like this literally at all. Like, look at that. What are all these off? Honestly, though, I have to say, for as close minded as the church can be, I'm glad they have like an array of people that you can pick as your avatar. I think that's so brave. That's brave. This old man really be speaking to me, though. He looks high as shit. I can get with it. Oh, I legitimately have to get up. Do I have to find a church? Then I realized this game is a religious spinoff of Pokemon Go. They think of everything these days, huh? You cannot, you are not about to get me to get up. It's a cute concept, gotta give it to JC himself for coming up with this app. I think it's one of those games that... <sighs> The sex game that we are playing is called Jump Rope 3D. Oh, it's like Double Dutch? Oh no. Bruh. These games are hurting my soul. I think these are all people playing online as we speak. Okay, do y'all remember that song from that movie, College Road Trip with Raven Simone, where she was like, get on the Double Dutch bus, Double Dutch bus, jump on it, on it. Yeah, well, that just came into my head and I thought it was a fever dream, but it's not, it's real. Okay, bye. Look at the way this man is dancing. I think that's all the apps we're gonna be playing today. If you watched to this point, thanks. And if you didn't, you did it. I also kind of want to like prompt you guys to like leave a comment maybe. So if you watch till here, leave down below an app that you cannot live without. So yeah, leave them down below. I'll see you guys next week. Thanks for all the love. I'll see you guys next week. Hopefully before, you know, global warming don't take us out. <laughs> Bye. Mm.